Alrighty, folks. Welcome, welcome, welcome to our Wednesday operation here at Squad Ops. My name is Slicetron. I'm going to be your commentator for tonight. Uh, we're going to be doing Operation Cloudfire. Uh, it's going to take place on the Yev map. Uh, we are all very familiar with that map at this point, I believe. And we're going to be having a little uh, Russia versus irregular militia action going on for tonight. Uh, militia will be defending. Russia will be attacking. Russia is going to be commanding for the Russians here. Uh, looks like we do have a command brief coming down here, so let's go ahead and grab that for you. Tell me exactly where you want, man. I'll make sure my guys are there. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna, when we do it, I'll drop some little marks um, where we are so it kind of shows what it's going to look like. Awesome. Well, it's still broken if you go into the menu. I can't aim anymore. Oh, never mind, now I can. <laughs> Need to press it a few times more or something. Well, while we wait for that to come down... Got one, the basket's two, reloading it, he'll be fine. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. The basket of puppies is coming back. He had to change his kit. Fourteen. Gotcha, gotcha. We have we, we have we have fourteen people. Where are the rest of them? I think, right? Am I counting right, right, correctly? Right. One, two, up. three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Whose squad is it spawned in? Whose squad is it spawned in? Someone's squad is it spawned in, I don't I think. squad two, squad three, and squad I got four. Mine. Squad. Yeah, we're, we're good. How are we have 14 people, though? Is it really that few? We should have 22 on the team, I suppose, with like uh, three for us. So that's an uh, additional 17, 18, 19 for slash turn around. I suppose, yeah, we are only missing two. Fucking hell. Well, it's disappointing that uh, Company Command only sent this many men, but I think we'll nonetheless be able to make do. So, welcome to Operation... Cloudfire. Now, as you may or may not have noticed, uh, due to inclement weather, our GPS systems are not really exactly working, per se. Uh, you may have noticed, if you look at your maps, that we appear to be about 100 meters uh, to the west of uh, where we should be, and also uh, where, where we actually are, rather, and also we appear to be at least, I think, probably what? It's got to be 10, 15 meters north of where we actually are on the map, right? Right. Take a look at where we are now. We are at more or less the fob marker. In fact, I'll mark exactly where we are. We're right at the fob marker. And yet, if you look at your map, we're not near the fob marker at all. This is going to present a unique challenge. So, again, referencing the map, you'll notice that I've marked various fob markers in the vicinity of a couple of villages, right west and east Mogoliovo, and uh, a wooded area between them that we believe is a militia camp. They have an ammo cache hidden somewhere in that area. And we, despite the inclement weather and uh, GPS fuckery, have nonetheless been tasked with going in and clearing it out. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to patrol over there in formation. We're going to turn north once we get to the appropriate landmarks. Uh, and then we're going to patrol in a, counter, or sorry, in a clockwise direction around through all of the possible locations until we find and destroy the enemy forward operating base. Yes, Raph? Raph, any questions? You said something, Raph? All right, map's open for formation brief. Uh, if you have not taken basic, this is going to be interesting. If you have, this should be remedial knowledge. I'm going to mark just south of us what the formation will look like. So the s squad two, your lead squad, is going to have the first person, second person, third person, and you're going to come out like that in a triangle. Rosa... It's going to be right here. My squad, squad three, going to set up here. 
and then squad four. So this is going to be a platoon column, but it's going to be uh, the wedge. So if you think about the columns like you have, we're all walking the line. We're going to do it in a wedge because we need to stay together. So your squad leaders will get you set up, but it's going to go where Rose is in the center. Squad two is going to be to the north of or to the west of her, and then the west and east, I guess north and south, west and east flanks are going to be um, probably about 50 to 80 meters spread apart between the two of them. Clear as mud. Uh. It's all gonna be fine. Yes. All right, so pretty solid plan coming out of Rosa there. Uh, choosing to move as a platoon. Uh, Raph, no we're not. Come fly over and look where we are. Good that you're in IC with the op box says for starting locations. Raph, look at where we are physically on the map. Yeah. Basing it off of grids, you're in Kilo 12 right now. Okay, and one of the starting points is Kilo 12 uh, fucking 9, is it not? The One of the starting points is not Kilo 12 9. Then why is that marked? Why is that drawn on the map? The top? They fucking because change it again? The, they, they did change it, and they changed it in the dock, and didn't change it on the paper, or whatever the deal is. Oh my I god. I don't really know. I fucking hate um, them. Fucking, uh, I want I, Dash be executed for not making a new graphic for this. So, I'm gonna have to ask. Where, you where am I? Where's the nearest one? Where's the nearest one, Raph? I don't care. One where's the nearest one? Southeast. Okay, well, that's fine. That's actually closer. That's helpful to my Mike, plan. So, can I just start Mike here? Fortune. It's literally, it's literally Mike like Fortune. more help. That, that's better for me. Okay, fine. We'll go down to fucking Mike. For, oh, whatever. Okay, fine. We'll go to Mike you. 14. Can you spawn me another transport truck? Yes, I will gladly drop. You have a transport right here on top of you. No, we need another one. We have fucking. Th we oh, can't we move all these one? people God. with one truck. Damn it. Yeah, I'll get you guys another one. All right, bit of a. Actually, let's see if we can load everyone up. Hold on. Bit of confusion with the opdoc op -doc there. Not that big of a deal. Uh, we'll hash that. Militia stationed here. They have chosen their point to defend, and that's going to be in this little field right here. Um, they have not selected a point with any hard cover, really. Very out in the open. So, interesting Raph, decision there. do you like there. give me a fucking, like, actual, like, terrain where, where, uh, is that really... Mike 14 is the group, because that, yep. that's not going to be where Mike 14 is, so we probably want to start north of Mike 14, right? Because where, where Mike just, 14 actually is, is probably like here. Just somewhere near there. I copy. I really don't care, just somewhere in that area. Copy, copy. Everyone go to my move marker. We're going to start like slightly north. Yeah, just as long as you're in that general area, I'm happy with it. All right, so once uh, Russia reaches their dismount point here, we should see live come down. Looks like both teams are ready. You know what, what we're going to do? We're going to use the transport trucks, and we're going to drive over to... Um... We're just going to drive to direct south of the objective, I think, after after live in the trucks. Or, well, actually, I think we can fit everyone in one truck. We're going to have to try. Since I've gone to the squad of five effective, if you guys need to uh, take the truck, we can move on foot. No, we should be able to get everyone, I think. Seneca, try and mount up all your guys in this truck. Let's see if we can do it. I'm interested to see what happens here. It looks like the militia do have a pretty good screen to the southeast here. Uh, their weakest point is this southwest. Looks like they do not have anybody watching southwest as of right now. 
But outside of that, uh, pretty good 360. Looks like we got about a fire team, maybe a squad moving into Novo proper. All right, we're good. So definitely going to be interested in seeing where these militia guys. I'll be driving go. the other truck. I'm right behind you. Well, except that we can't we can't use the other truck, can we, Raf? We we don't get two trucks, do we? We oh, only get yeah, one. We can't. I believe you is the case. I'm running it. Use, yeah. All right, we're gonna we're just gonna put people right. over there. I'm just gonna drive people over their truck. I'm gonna run two shifts to fucking get people over there in the stupid ass truck. I can do this because I, I can run us over two. We're gonna deposit people um like out here in the field. Something? We're gonna we want deposit. To stay back. Yeah, Seneca. Or, um, let's have person. cars and squad stay back. Cars and squad will stay back. Everyone else will. Everyone else will go. I think it was another squad. Mm -hmm. They what? I get the blame. They looked at the written grids and the written coordinates for where they Jesus placed their Christ. Thing. Jesus where Christ. Jesus Christ. you guys looked at the, like, map grid. This so is gonna be so fucked up. Okay. Yeah. Stand by then, stand by, folks. We might so be the, determining the, a new southern point. Right. Let me, let me fucking, yeah, let me fucking give you the grids, right. everyone. Stand by, stand by. <laughs> it's gonna be so fucked up. Hold on one second, gross. folks. Okay, so H11. I11. Lemon. J11. Oh. H12. I12. And J12. What the f- Oh, this is so foobar. This is gonna be amazing. Okay. Alright, we're gonna go. Start where we wanted to, because that would have been fun. That's right true, there. yeah. That would have been hysterical. You are hurt if you want me to heal you real quick. Copy. I'll, yeah, I'll hop out real quick. But uh, okay. We have a new deposit point for everyone. Stand by. It's a wild way to say what drop off. What is going on here? No, Raph. We we got it. We're just gonna do the same plan, but we Stop will start everyone further. I'll drive everyone to further south initially. It'll be Stop fine. Stop this thing. Actually, we don't even have to do that. Fuck, we're everyone. We're just gonna, we're just gonna go fucking walk it out. We're just gonna fuck. walk it out. We're gonna go like first. Uh, okay. We're just literally just gonna walk like, the like in the formation that we described, straight. Fuck, if you in, sprain your ankle, I'm not healing. Around. It'll be fine. We fine. Put that like away. That. Put that away. We all get it. Yeah. Okay. I'm crooked. Well, 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 that bag, bro. Take that bag. Let's, let's get, get, get everyone. Get the formation set up and uh, let's get rid of it. So funny. Pulling out control. the blicky. Can't take the heat. You guys set for live? <laughs> yeah, we're pretty much set, I would say. I would be ready for live at any time. And by any time, I mean within 10 you're seconds. Alright, Freddy, you're here. I saw here. who that was. <laughs> I saw who that was. You ain't seen nothing. Yeah, alright, yeah, you keep on running over there. Yeah, right, don't mind swear. me, I got some I'm chips. Just... Yeah. <laughs> During that wait period. Uh, we should see live coming down any moment now. Okay. Lambu. You're here. And three, two, one, go. There it is. All right, squad leaders, try and get you guys information as we patrol, but we're going to start patrolling west. A from herd heading westbound. In our formation, you know, to try and, uh, well, probably like, let's go with, um, 287, roughly. It's probably our bearing. Roger, 287. We'll have, of course, Seneca in the middle, and we got Krusty and Karzin on our flanks. On. See, the most fucked up part about all of this is that we can look at the map and think we know what's there, but we actually have no clue what's in any of these grids. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! It's 
gonna be funny as hell. All right, well, we're just gonna we're just gonna patrol. We're gonna loop around, and we're gonna eventually encounter contact and try and find uh, this fucking cache. So we do have that fire team posted up in the south part of Novo here. I do believe that Lower Moog is gonna be within the grids, um, and so also is East Moog. And, uh, I think two as well, East Novo, or no, West Novo is going to be in there, but East Novo will not, so. They, they could have put it, I would imagine, in one of those three spots. Um, I don't imagine they'd put it in the other places, because other places would kind of suck, but who knows. Alright, this is trippy as hell. We are currently approaching... West Novo. Repeat, we are approaching the West Novo outskirts. Hey, from Looks like we're going to patrol more or less straight through West Novo, potentially. Actually, no, we're going to stay outside of it, I think. We're going to be close to the airfield. The south side. Yeah. Well, no, I mean more as in, like, where our practical, based on our, like, planned movement, where we're going to wind up. I think we're going to wind up being outside of, uh, Novo during the patrol. Roger. Four might partially sweep it, but that would be about it. Dude, that fucking wedge for squad two, baby. That shit look nice. Mine's the yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, we're just passing the main MSR now. Copy. Two, you are drifting a little bit north, by the way, off the uh, the planned line. You're drifting into Four's lane. Okay, from pushing southwest. So the big question here is, is Dick's folk going to get the spot off? Doesn't look like he has the spot yet. Folks, we're going to go ahead to Hotel 12 and then we're going to turn north and we're just going to keep working our way around um, clockwise through all the grids. I expect yeah, us to hit contact good. before that most likely, but we cannot be sure. Because, yeah. We don't know where they are. They don't know where we are. I don't see them north of us in the uh, the town, but of course it doesn't mean they're not there. Okay, looks like we're still, we're scraping the edge more or less of, uh, Nova, which is fine. But I don't see any militia contact in there, so we can probably check off that grid. Although it's possible it could be in the north side of it, so we'll have to wait to confirm that until the very end. I'm willing to bet dollars for donuts they are in lower Moog or in, uh, east Moog. So I'd say be prepped for contact about five minutes and if there's not contact in about five minutes it'll happen probably about ten we ran out of supplies actually that actually happened here all right nova's on lower moog yet but we are slowly getting there I'd say two you could probably keep proceeding um west uh west like northwestish like just barely northwest from your current position towards lower Moog, right? You set your compass yeah, at two eight nine. You should be headed right on the money, right? Two eight nine. Yeah, yeah I'll, uh, I'll I'll push the guys across this uh, field in just a second. This open area. Copy. 
So yeah, we're headed for H12. Ford, do you have any vision uh, up there? And Negative, we've been glassing it, haven't seen anything. Copy. Yep. They're probably wondering what the fuck's taking so long, but they're gonna understand next round. This is, uh, very different. <laughs> Yeah, this whole map is just so I can keep my guys in the correct formation. Yep. No, definitely. So neither team has spotted anybody as of yet. Got Rosa going for the long flank into Moglio. Which means she's going to be pushing into the point from the western side. Alright, uh, squad two's gonna go more deliberate and uh, try to see if we have any contacts to the northwest. I've already lost all ability to terrain associate and have no idea where I'm actually at. <laughs> Presti, you are. Um... Probably about a hundred meters. So it's probably about three hundred meters south of Lower Moog. Two is about to enter Lower Moog. Well, actually, they already are in Lower Moog. I assume. Two, are you in Lower Moog yet? We all just lost now. Negative. Yeah. We're on the western. No, we're. On, I'm sorry. We're on the eastern side of that lake. Fuck. Okay. Yeah, A firm. <laughs> Hell yeah, brothers. Hell yeah, I love it. Okay, I can see Lower Moog. I can see Lower Moog. I see the yellow nursery house, it is fucking, I can see it in my binos, so that means, too, if you keep proceeding uh, west, you'll hit lower Moog. <laughs> Afram, do you want me to provide, actually, just overwatch on the east side of uh, lower Moog for now, right now? Or you want to continue to uh, west? Let's just keep going through it. I do not see any contact in lower Moog, so they probably are not actually in there. Um, I'm willing to bet they're up in the northern grids at this point, uh, based on our current situation. I don't think they know where they are. They don't know where they yeah. are either, yeah, no, they have no fucking clue where they are either. Next round, we're gonna have a clue where we are, though, because I've, I'm gonna fucking, we're gonna put it in the goddamn, we're gonna put it in West Novo, so we have a clue where the fuck we are. <laughs> so we're just not gonna leave West Novo either. West. We're also advancing west, and we're gonna turn north soon. Um, I think we're gonna turn north once we actually hit Lower Moog. Once we actually hit it, we'll turn north, because that's a terrain feature that makes sense to turn north at, since that's like, yeah, it's a sensible choice. Okay, so four, I would say... Pretty soon you're going to want to stop for because once you get to the edge of the lake, you're going to want to turn north. Uh, and then... Yeah. Like, basically, for once you get once you get on level with me, you're going to want to turn north to proceed to the other side of Lower Moog, then turn north, I would say. Okay. Just, like, basically keep going west until you, uh... Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> Raph, are they wondering where we are yet? I, I, I don't even know. Where we are. Yeah, I don't even know where the fuck I am, and I'm in admin cam, okay? I don't want to hear it. <laughs> well, four, four, you wanna... Everything was right before. Cars, you wanna hold up, hold up, no idea. Now it's all fucked. Now it's borked, because he didn't have an idea, that we didn't have an idea, that nobody had an idea. Yep, that nobody has an idea. This is exactly what I want to do it, though, because this is, like, actually... This will be a very interesting off experience. Alright, so four, I would say sit tight, and then two, proceed further west. Hey, from proceeding west. Yep. And then, uh, once you get on the other side of four, I would say then we can start heading north. And we'll sweep into the Hotel Eleven. We're gonna work around the edge of the lake, basically. And we'll sweep into Hotel Eleven. And sweep up through there and check it. Alright, 
right, we're going to see the Russians start to flow into lower Moog here. They will find no resistance. All right, two, I'd say you're good to turn north. Looks like you're about 100 meters uh, off force position. So I'd say turn north and start heading north for hold position for now. Wait until two gets about 100 meters north of you. Heard. Two. Copy, yep. okay. Yep. Going north. Heading, heading north, heading north. Also, I hang hang more north uh, northeast than north, I'd say, at this point. Because we do want to be heading into good. H12. Or sorry, H11, rather. Basically, actually, your move mark is a pretty good guy's eye. Militia right. still holding fast. No movement out of them. Just make sure you don't go into the lake. Like, stay stay to the uh, west of the lake. <laughs> but, yeah. Other than that, yeah, you're we'll in a pretty stay good west spot. Of the lake. Yep, stay west of the lake. And then, I'd say, again, thinking in terms of terrain features, they, it looks like there's a decent forest cover down there. So, I'd say you probably want to work around the edge of the lake from here on out, unless we call you further north. Because you're in a great spot to uh, just kind of work through the the middle chunk of the keypads and such. But all right, two. Let's uh, let's head more northeast, okay, from... more northeast, less less e less west, more northeast. Seven. Fucking hell. We're only at. Oh boy, we're in lower Bogue right now. This is so fucked up. This is so <laughs> fucked up. Oh my god. This is so fucked up. Okay, just keep heading northeast, I guess. Fucking hell. This is a big meme. And we're just gonna head into uh, H11 now. We're just gonna patrol into H11. It's gonna be fine. Holy shit, so yeah, four, you might have to walk in the lake, actually. My bad. All good, we're gonna loop around here and we'll push through the lake. Yep. I'd wait for, I think, I think honestly, two should probably cross first. Yeah, I'll cross, just let me know when four set up so they can at least cover us as we move across this open area. Definitely, yeah. Four, once you're, once you're ready to cover two, give me the call. Then three, I think right, you're actually going to be, Crusty, you're probably going to be moving through the fucking drainage there. Um, Already passed it. We're past the, uh, the bridge. We're about to start wrapping amazing. to the east. Copy, yep. Yeah, four, let me yeah, know when looking. you're all set. This is trippy as hell. Four is set. Two's moving. Excellent. Friend Doc is uh, in the back. Still in wait. Four twos across across the lake. Heard four moving. We're going to see the Russians slowly start to press into northern Moog. Third two, four moving. All right, and then folks, we have to patrol through H11, which I don't know what's in H11. We're going to find out. <laughs> it could be an open field. It could be a forest with rocks and stuff. It could be a town. We don't know. We have rotated to the east. We are pushing through the top in the east. Our north to south is a little uh, almost accurate. Our east to west is inaccurate. So where you see copy, us is okay. almost exactly where we are. Copy, copy. Okay, okay. So it's north to south is almost accurate, but east to west is super distorted. That makes sense. That makes sense. All right, to go ahead and proceed uh, northeast once four gets up to your position. We're going to check out H11. Roger, moving. You know, I think we should do this more. This is interesting. I should 
deliberately distort the mini maps. You should. Or have no maps. Imagine that. <laughs> no maps. Oh my god. Go by memory. <laughs> See, the worst thing about this, too, though, is because east-to-west is distorted, we are probably further away from each other than uh, it looks like on the map, too. That's the fucked up thing. Like, I'm pretty close to four on my east, at least. Yes, but in reality, you're probably more like, um, 100 meters away instead of 25, or maybe 50 instead of 25, right? Mm -hmm. Correct, yeah, definitely. Because of the distortion. Alright, let's proceed... Further into Hotel 11, see what the fuck's up there. I'm trying to glass it right now to the northeast. Hold on, stand by. Definitely. Yeah, do we have buildings up there? What, what, what's uh, what's north and what's east of us, I guess? Do you want me to head up to that direction? I, I would, yeah. There's a note over here. Okay, fuck. So that's I'm looking fucking... at those buildings in the north of the grid. That's East Moog. That's East Moog. It's not West Moog. We're, we're, in, the, we're in the edge of East Moog. We're in between... Uh, east and West Moog, it looks like. What I'm looking at to my left is the farm at the foot of West Moog, potentially. And so yeah, I think we're... On that is that, that's East Moog over there, right? Yeah, that's fucking East Moog. Yeah. Alright, Mr. Tropod. Alright, well, let's patrol, uh, let's probably get the platoon line oriented east and then start patrolling through H, I, and J, 11, I guess. On the edge of uh, Eastern Moog. And then we'll fucking sweep back down and hit Juliet 12 if we don't run into contact by the time we hit J11. It's probably gonna be J11. I'm gonna I'm gonna guess that right now. Is they're gonna they're gonna put it in the barn and hey, yeah. If we look on the map and reference the crossroads in what is on our map, Juliet 11, I'm gonna bet that it's in that fucking barn complex, right? Right on that map. That's obviously not gonna be where it is in the map, but it's gonna be somewhere between us and the uh, the fucking edge of these patrol points. <laughs> I'm gonna put the put my money down right now that that's where about put the fob. I'm not seeing any fucking activity in East Moog, so it's gotta be it. Contact someone in behind me. So we're just gonna patrol platoon line into it and take it down. Hey, from I got eyes on the infantry now. east, 300 meters at the edge of the road in the bush. Contact? Is that you said? What's your Carson? Squad four has eyes on contact times one, 300 meters east. Charles Understood. Up on this burn. Approximate grid India eleven three nine. India eleven three nine. Yeah, I'm willing to bet then. I'm willing to bet that that, that fucking garage. That's where that's where it's at. With the fobs in there. The right the so we're just gonna want a platoon push. I guess is probably the most right. sensible way to do this, and just just sweep right through. All right, contact is yeah, being made. Yeah, fucking Dashby gets Force first blood. Or first blooded. Like, yeah. Three and two should be able to maneuver because they don't have a good eyesight on three and two. Yeah, I think uh, the I'm north wrap side. North, if we wrap, wrap around, around north, flank. yeah, yeah sounds good. Three. Yeah, do it, do it, do it. And then four, just keep engaging them right now. Three and two will wrap. Dash B is disconnected. Did you guys kill it that quickly? God damn. Nice. Man is upset. Man is fucking upset. That's hysterical. Start out, let's start pushing, let's start pushing, and then uh, four, just keep fixing them for now. If you can eventually push up four, go ahead and take the opportunity, but you don't have to push up until you think it's absolutely uh, free to do so. We have a militia fire team approaching from the southeast. Yeah, I'm not really seeing a lot of contact east of this current position, so I really do think that most of the platoon's probably on the uh, the landmark that we can't see yet, that... that Shed that on the map is in Juliet 11, but probably based on all these fucked up grids, it's probably closer to like Juliet 11.4 instead of Juliet 11.6. God damn. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're on the paved road. This road leads to where their fob probably is, just so you're aware. Which is. To the road that you're currently on, just so you're aware, leads to where the likely fob location is, right? Um, when you get over that. When you get over that little lip in the hill, Seneca, you're going to be running right into that compound I think the, the fucking thing's at. 
Oh, is that red smoke? Is that ours or is that theirs? Yeah, you firm, uh, hold on, stand by. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, that contact just hit the road. We can see it from here. That's gotta be it. That was a very good shot. If it uh, would have hit a tree over here, that could have taken or out three guys. To move up. I'm not sure, but... Yep, we're starting our bound. Nice. We got contacts far. We're going to start pushing two down. Copy, yep, go so for it, three. All in that grid. Yep, I'm willing to bet that fucking compound that we can see from down here. That's got to be it. Militia fire team it's gotta be it. is here the, and the causing chaos. Grid square. The take out Perry. Oh, like four taking contact. Four taking contact within grenade range southeast of our pause. Copy. Unless we try to flank it. All right, two and three. I guess we should see if we can keep pressing. Cause I do think that fob's gonna be up this way. Three, you fixing those enemies to the south? Push. We're kind of pushing back with some suppressive. Yeah, if you want to do, uh, yeah, if you want to do some overhead for me, I'll, uh, I'll get in close. Fire team is taking a beating. They are now too effective. Or three effective, rather. And they are going to be. Getting out of there with their tail between their legs. Majority of the platoon is over here on the northeast. And they are about to run into a large patch of enemy militia. Start checking bushes, but don't shoot in front of me. Zadi is playing with his life over here. All right, so this tree line over southeast by the red smoke. Zadi's going for cross. Takes a hit, but he's not dead. Dead, dead, dead. Good kill, good kill. Moving up. Looks like two got uh, Give me cover. close. Yeah. Charlie, let's Copy. cross the road. Oh, you're already crossed. Yeah, there you go. Straight A, straight A. That's down the road. We're, getting, we're taking contact uh, east down the road, about like 200 meters through, so if you see that, uh, yeah, there's laying up. Nate goes out. Yeah, my suspicion is yeah. that it's that compounder being renewed. Red smoke about to go out into me AR. Look, red smoke's a little short, but it's still roughly AR it's position. East. It's in the bush a little bit further than that. Mind, already smoke. Obviously, Chain of Command, if I die, Krusty's in charge. If Krusty dies, um, I think we're gonna go with Seneca. You'll be in charge, but you'll probably also die if hey, Krusty Charlie, dies. So, no, Karzin, uh, you'll probably south. wind up in charge. <laughs> I don't know how far they're at. Because, yeah, Seneca, did he, you, uh, you, myself, and Krusty are all in the same area. So, if, uh, if one of us dies, probably all of us will die in quick succession. <laughs> Would be my suspicion. Yeah, enemy crossing. Runs through a field and he gets Enemy, caught. Uh, squad, he just ran out of that compound. Um, I'm gonna make sure he's dead. Which yeah, that I think I think it's definitely on that fucking compound. There's no way. It's, there's no way it's not. They're defending it so much. Oh yeah, you guys just killed him. Good okay. stuff, Krusty. Good stuff. Yeah, this it's gotta be this compound. There's no way. They're defending this so hardly. They're so harshly. So much uh, other three. We're gonna be, we're gonna be uh, doing some suppression for you southeast east as well. A lot of casualties coming out on the militia side.
contact taking I place on the south I think they're in Novo after all. I'm looking at the compound. Um, to me, it's looking not fortified at all. Hey, four, we got contacts in between me and you about, like, maybe like two guys. Actually, hold on, I got bags. There's a couple of contacts between us. We're also engaging contact to our southeast, about 50 meters. Yeah, bag Different. in the middle of the woods. I got a guy shooting off of a bag, uh, fucking 117 off I'll my paws, getting marked with red smoke. Lawn darts is getting surrounded over here. I got vehicles to the east. Yeah, I got a spandrel to the east? Should that be a thing? What? I'm taking accurate grenades on me, so they're fucking somewhere close to me, and I don't know why. It, it's a thing, but you shouldn't... It shouldn't be east of you, because that's not one of the possible... Okay, let me fix this. Starts get spotted that's not, that's and taken out. You gotta tell me if it's there, Raph. Is it there? Is it actually east? It hey, is, Raph, is it in a legal location. It is in a legal location, okay. Yes. So it is not east of three, is what you're telling me? Yes. Okay, okay. cool. Oh, yeah. So starting this the spanner's over near me, I think. I should the engine rev. I think it's the compound I, I called out still. There's fucking lots of orbits behind the compound I called out. Cause I, there's lots of bags wire back here and I fucking just heard the spandrel rev southeast of me. So until further, like, until we get anything else, like, uh, basically the fob marker that's on the map right, is basically wait, wait. accurate. Break, just break. assume that, that that's the case. Yep, the that spandrel is. is essentially on my location. Copy. It's interesting. It's gotta be within 25 meters of the fob, so that means the fob's gotta be basically on your location. What the fuck? Do you want me to wrap around uh, to the northeast with three? I'd say so, yeah, because three is basically on their fob. Is what, what this comes down to is three has to basically be on top of their fob for the spam to be within, uh, within fucking. Hey, from. Except, wait, there's no way it's within 25 meters of you, three. It's gotta be like close Spandrel to me. Spandrel is taking hot firing, shots. Just, like up near me. Uh, Joe Violence, it seems. Okay, so a good chunk like out of Krusty. I don't think Krusty's gonna survive. Yep, Krusty does go down. Hey, sorry if I missed him while in contact. Did we have eyes in the OBJ? Uh, not really. Wait, Krusty, where is the span? Like, can you see the spandrel? Like, what, what's what's the estimated grid on it? Uh oh, did Krusty die? I think Krusty's dead. Fuck, Freddy. Where's that spandrel? Where's the spandrel, Freddy? What's the what's the grid? What's the grid? Dead smoke. It's in the. Juliet 11, or Juliet 11, 6. And that's Bandrel out of rockets by now. A hundred meters uh, to the west of me. Hey, commands down. Uh, I'll be taking over. Uh, Freddy, keep up that movement uh, on the backside. For Dewey, uh, how are you looking over there? We just cleared out a compound to our pause. We're gonna try to make it east and then north. Is that where you want us? Yeah, go, try. Yeah, try to go east and north as best as possible. There's gonna be enemy infantry, like little little bits and pieces. But last uh, lo known location was red smoke on that enemy spandrel, right, Freddy? All right. Uh, my squad yeah, is fixing the enemies in the middle as of right now. We're gonna be moving up uh, here soon, so we can start uh, like surrounding them in some sort of way. Uh, we do have that fire team headed up by Dick's Bolt coming up the rear. Mr. Nightmare picking up two kills so far. Force trying to move northeast. Yeah, no problem. We're, uh, we're taking some casualties in my squad to our southeast. I'm gonna try to mark them on white smoke. You might be able to see it before. Heard two, we're on the hunt. Uh, 
marked white smoke enemy last location across the field if you see that. Heard two, we're engaging. Serbin, very low on health. And goes does go down. Looks like that came from 61. Freddy and his fire team are starting to engage. Uh, we're, we're looking good. The enemy's uh, probably near four's location and three's location. If I'm, if I'm right. Got some sandbags to myself. Andrew takes like a hit. Readers. Sounds good. Four's about to push in. We've got my Bravo on it. Advancing at the start. Hey, from. I uh, keep it the good work, guys. Pod. Bow. Grenade comes out. That's not going to connect. Two grenades. What you say, Nate? Out. I did not have one. Nope. Nope. Contact southeast. All right, I'm gonna distance unknown. Looks like they lost all of two. Anybody with command comms in here? What two? Crossing, 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 crossing. Ozadi, what do you see? Is this your smoke Set. in front of me? Come on up. Negative. Those within 10 meters. Militia are getting pretty thin on numbers on the objective proper. I'll take point. Radio right here, radio right here. Dick's Folk and his fire team are back at it, coming up the rear again. survive he does go down all of the Russians are dead over here I'm moving to this tree line there are enemies close enemies close on that tree line be careful which one Should I open oh, friendly word yes yeah. it goes down direct west Russians are now four man strong. I'm, I'm backing off to the south here with you. I'm getting out of here. Al Zadi. Freddy also picking up a kill. It is now five to one in favor of militia. Is that you getting shot up from the west? Negative, I just killed someone up here though. Someone just threw a grenade over me. From my west. 
Yeah, it was at me. The Russians are in a pretty bad spot considering three three fourths of them are low on health. And Watts Watts does go down. Freddy has him clocked. But Maxi shoots through the bush first. It's down to Joe and Alzadi. Alzadi goes for a nade. That's towards Maxi. Did pepper him a bit. I'm sorry, you on comms? Sorry, come again? I had a contact close to me where you threw that nade and two contact to my south across the field. Copy. I'm gonna try to deal with that contact to the west. I'm pretty beat up. That guy's moving up on me close south. I'm trying to get eyes on that. They're gonna be close to the spandrel, I think. I'm pretty sure I heard a weapon come out. And Dick's folk is now moving in. It's two to five in favor of militia here. Situation is not looking good for the Russians. Grenades. I'm gonna try and crawl across this field to you. I would keep the crossfire. Okay. All contacts are gonna be west southwest as of right now. Roger. How much further west can you go? Not very far, it's open past this building. I can move kind of southwest this uh, hedge. I can feel myself crawling into this guy. You want to recon by fire and see if they uh, try to push to you? <laughs> sure, I guess. So, you see where I'm sh uh, aiming right now? Or where I'm looking on the map? Yeah, I see. Let up the whole tree line and get the fuck out of there. <laughs> okay. Ready? Go for it. I baited out some return shots to my west. Somebody fired, I didn't even hear it. Yeah, someone fired back at me to my west, probably about like 60 meters. At least they're coming.
So we just have to secure the spandrel, right? Is that it? I'm not quite sure, because we were on top of it and there was nothing called, so... You guys, you guys have to secure the spandrel and the radio, which are together. Did we not secure it already? I was right on top of that thing. Oh, you want to secure it more or EXO? Secure it more? Uh, I'll go back to it. Okay, I'll try to head over there too. So we're either on top of it or in the brush to the right of it. I'm a car one. to secure the radio, you guys have to dig it down. Oh, we got Cheese Man right on top of it now. Do you have eyes on the radio, Joe? Radios could be right on top of the spandrel right next to it. Copy, I have eyes on the spandrel. Do you want to crawl up to it and I'll, <laughs> I'll try to protect you as best I can? Yeah, I'm gonna wrap around one second. Alright. Let's assume that they try to push your last position, I'm coming to you. the chances there's somebody in here? Uh, probably. Uh, there goes Joe, finally. It's all down to Alzadi. Fuck this, I'm next going. Nah. Fuck it, we ball. And down goes Alzadi. That's going to conclude round one. Operation Cloudfire. GG and a victory to Militia for this round. Uh, we're going to take a brief intermission. We'll be right back with round two of Operation Cloudfire.
right, folks, we're back with round two of Operation Cloudfire. Welcome back. Welcome back. We saw a militia victory for last round. Let's see what happens in round two here. So we will be assaulting east to west. We're going to follow the train. We're going to be a little sneaky sneak. We are going to have Sturban taking point, followed by Needeep acting as flank security. Whatever Sturban's weakest flank is, Needeep's going to going to clean it up. That will probably put Needeep in some really interesting positions if, Need, if, if Sturban can keep the enemy occupied. While that's happening, Dick's folk will be rear security. He's going to ensure that Sturban's, Sturban's rear is, is always protected. We want nothing to happen to Sturban's rear. That being said, we are going into a really, really bad environment. The terrain, you guys have already seen it. The GPS guidance systems are all out of whack. It's, this is going to be more important that you're communicating to those next to you and using visual callouts in front of you than giving grids. Grids are not going to help us in this particular setting. Uh, the enemy team uh, decided to share how, how bad of a time they had trying to assault and plan a thing with the GPS being out of whack. We don't need GPSs. In fact, we're not even going to use grids. No one should be using grids at this point. Follow the red arrows. Use visual cues in front of you. Use the bearings on the little compass rows at the bottom. I don't think it's actually a compass rose, but we're not going to talk about that and then follow your SL and your FCL's directions. Any questions? All right, nothing heard. All right, Sturban, you're gonna be taking point, leading the guys along the red arrow, and we'll take care of your flanks and your rear. You just keep your guys moving forward. Let's go ahead and break them out. Stand by for life. Represent. All right, pretty solid comprehensive plan. Uh, Bao also choosing to move as a platoon, for the most part. Let's take a look and see what's going on with the militia. Move them to the starting line. Nice. Roger. It's not good. One second. Copy. All right, so Militia choosing to take refuge in Novo this round. We're going to see if they can play it to their favor. And it looks like they should be ready. So live should be coming here. Wedge slash those arrows. That's a lot of firepower. Well, we're likely to walk into them first, so I'd, I would like to not be yeah. lined up for some happy AR uh, to kill us in one burst. Yeah, no, I don't disagree with that. Do we ever run faster with a pistol, or do we just run with the RPKs? You die quickly with your pistol, and you run the Fair. same. Keep that RPK up, would be my advice. <laughs> yes, please. I've increased stamina, I think. No, I'm just yeah, gonna run only... around with the... It's only master the RPG. Though, so they're not fair. I will stay between Charlie and Bravo, and hopefully not be the first one to die between both of your fire teams. Yeah, 
Yeah, Mar Marksman get the run speed uh, bonus points because, you know, they're lacking in the intelligence points. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they've got that agility build. Alright, one minute to sixty seconds to live. One's right. I'm sorry, three's right. Hell yeah. Uh squad three slash squad one. Are you ready for that? Dex left. Yeah, I'm good. Sturban, are you ready for life? Yep, I'm ready for live. Copy. For what it's worth, the bridge is our first objective. I was going to say that, but Sturban, set the tone. We we find the bridge, and then we follow the intent. Bow, just so you know, bridge is on squad 5 move mark. So you don't get messed up. God, is that you? Can you Thank also you. tell me the winning lotto numbers for the, um, okay. That's, uh, six nine six nine six nine. Sounds good. Oh, hell yeah. As soon as we're done, we're, I'm gonna go get, go get that. Well, we're gonna go at your speed, so whatever speed you lead off with, that's what we're gonna go with. In the immortal words of Ricky Bobby, if you ain't first, you last. You could be second? <laughs> you could be third? Hell, you could even be fourth! Nah, if you ain't first, you're last. Oh, Ricky, I was high when I said that. Alright, so the Russians are starting on the swamp. And they're gonna be moving through this drainage ditch. Right here. Squad 2, you only need to worry about your squad. Make sure that your squad is successful, Sturban. The rest of the squads, we're going to be paying attention to you. You're paying attention to your squad and communicating contact reports. We will deal with the rest. Copy that. Yeah, Sturban, you're the assault squad. We're the support squads here to keep you alive. Okay. I'll work on it. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at what the militia have planned, see what kind of movements they've been making. Looks like they're Keeping it pretty tight inside Novo. Playing it safe, playing it smart. They will have a screen on the north consisting of one squad. Uh, they will be the first to make contact. And it looks like their objective is to lure the Russians in. I don't see any guys on rooftop. Yeah. Taking uh, high points to try and scout. So they're going to be playing it nice and tight. Copy that. Thank you, Whiteside. Appreciate it. Sturban, if you haven't already, do not pass that down. Just keep the frequency at a good, healthy pace for the next 250 meters. This is your chance to reinforce best practice. If you see guys doing weird shit, this is the next 250 meters are for you to fix it. Roger that.
stand by. Yeah, we're, we're going the right way. Russians are continuing to progress in, uh, in a southerly direction. Militia have not moved. They're playing it real tight. All right, Sturban, if you're happy with the formation, let's pick up the pace just a tiny bit. Copy that. Roger that. All right, looks like the platoon is holding up here. Let's slowly cross underneath this bridge through the culverts. You want me to move west? Uh, you have the arrows on the map, and you also have uh, the air point. Continue. Good copy. Yep. 
militia is not doing any looking out. We are barely extremely familiar. Nobody has spotted anybody. Anyone see something that's enemy, yeah. shoot it first. Affirmative <laughs> direction. We're very likely to step on them. Pretty confident saw helmet there, but I don't like this. I'm gonna check. Command all squads, command all squads. Yeah, real bad. Sturban, now hear this. Uh, per, per some intelligence and high command, uh, you know, geosynchronous GPS satellite orbit debauchery, uh, let's go ahead and get the platoon oriented in a south by southeast fashion, and let's go ahead and take it east. Platoon to move south by southeast. How copy, Sturban? Copy, south by southeast, moving south. South by southeast, moving south. Copy that. Alright, squad two, uh, squad one and three hold. Maintain flank and rear security. South by southeast. South by southeast, copy. Uh, do you want us to stay where we are, or do you want us to get on the south side of, uh, um, two to protect them? Uh, let's have you be west security, while knee-deep is east security, while Sturban moves southeast. West security, okay. Good copy. I want us to get to this blue building here, like, uh, to our northeast, I And then hopefully be able to look down the road. Talk to me. I guess we know where they are. Spandrel the, uh, pops a shot, shot off. Shot from the southeast. Never mind, it's not gonna stop shit. That landed literally in the field next to me. That that almost that, yeah, that was not good. All right, knee deep. Let's get that uh, let's get that north we security on Sturban going. To Bravo. Good copy, Sturban. Get set for contact. Dix, maintain rear security. Knee deep. Get on his flank. Hey, bro. Sturban, once everyone's set, execute. Copy that. Once everybody's set, I will execute the push. Militia is still playing it super tight. Haven't even seen these guys poke their heads out.
It's gonna be wide open here, guys. Are all squad yeah, set? We got yeah. a few buildings like 150 meters to our southeast. Yep. We do have the wheat field here or the high grass. Let me glass one sec. Okay, copy. We'll start our movement. I try smoke line it. All right, Sturban, good luck. Knee deep. Thanks. Thanks. Keep him safe. I've got one. You want me to send it? Enemy contact 200 meters main road sandbags from my Charlie element. Good copy. Mad east side. Sturban, your flank is on your north. Alright guys, so east, southeast. Roger. Be very careful here. There's a lot of little alleyways, crossroads, etc. It's good space. Yeah, don't do that. Let's try each other. Ignore the EMS as well. Yeah, let's not all die, please. The road crossings are the real, the real shit here. Notwithstanding all the buildings. Roger. Roger, Spandle is east of us, like two, three hundred meters. Watts Watts drawing first blood on Maxi. Northeast. Lead this is dead. Spawn is down. I'm back to you. Now you see what they're in. It's a blue shadow room. Contact at least. And these guys have woken up. Hey, Dave's down. All right, Dex, get up here. All right, I'm going. Pretty good ambush okay, tactics squad. coming out of the militia. The northeast, we've got contacts uh, 100 meters direct east from one of the other buildings. Copy. Cuckoo, keep up the distraction, keep engaged. Dix is going to support uh, what's left of squad 2 to push. Uh, can you hear me? Can you guys hear me? Heard. Yep, now I'm through Dix. Okay, yeah. Um, yeah, we're, we're moving again on the south side. So we're going to see if we can pull over fire away from the north side, essentially. On the right. Okay, copy. Do you, want to, do you want me to push across? Yeah, push across. I'll cover you. Copy. Crossing. On my direct move. Got him? Yeah, going back. Lambda just barely getting out of there. Enemy contact east down the main road, 100 meters. Six, you got it. Uh, yeah, we're engaging contacts. Guys, don't get too close. <sighs> you especially need to get like a flat. Contact east down the road. Keep it flowing, Predix. Keep it flowing. Yep, yeah. We've already killed the marksman on one of the roofs. We're taking them out. They're all focused on you. We're just. In their flank. Cuckoo, keep that fire up. Keep that fire up. Every every mag you drop. It's like a proxy war. Commanders 
Houston 10, keep pushing. 2AC, Sturban, followed by Dix. Copy that, we'll keep pushing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna push this. Heard, 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 heard. Yep, heard, heard. So there was a guy in this, there was a guy on this building that we killed not yeah, too long ago. Yeah, there's a yeah. bunch of sandbags there, up there. Garage is there. Yeah. And then there's more to the north for sure. Howdy fellers. This building Howdy. looks clear. I don't see anybody in it. I'll go in. I'm with you, I'm with you, behind you. Great. Nate, Nate. Nate. Clear. Where, where? Oh, did that you was throw really a grenade? Harry no, accidentally grenades no, himself. Yeah, this is space. One grenade's gonna kill. In the bush. Is that close? In the bush, right here on the building. Copy. In the bush. Taking a lot of losses as they try to grind into this. To the tree line to get a better firing position. South, copy. Hey, squad two, we got a marksman or M16 to your north. We're gonna try to engage. One's got his pistol out. In the blue house! What is the window? I have eyes on the spare girl. On it is. Going out. Stay back. Spandrel is too... Vange yourself. Grenades coming out, none of them connected. I'm hit. Finish it. I'm I'm pinned down here. I can't I can't move to you. Yeah, just hold hold what you got. Hold what you got. There's three enemies who are southeast here at 120 degrees. Airframe, there's one south to southeast as well, about fucking 20 meters past that one building. Six folk is still Pin down over here at this shed. We got we know they're here in front of us. Let's go. Yeah, wait, wait, wait. Let's get on the smoke down. Right on. Cross into the road here to the no to the north. Uh, we're better off. I think. I'm crossing back over. Not a lot of casualties coming out. Things are grinding down to a stalemate. Out it seems. To the south, mm -hmm. then. 
Yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah whichever direction you think is the safest. Because if he if he yeah. can't see you in the field, you can't see him in the field. Yeah, that grenade was on fire. That's this white building. You got the definition to our white building. building. I can light it. I can fucking light it, dude. That okay, might do it, be the best call. Clear your back flash. Clear your back flash. Back flash is clear. I'm gonna suppress him. Stand by. Okay. Good effect. Do you have any more smoke? Smoke on those windows. Dick's Folk is trying to swing to the north, or the east rather. Finally goes down. Just Sturban and Foo now. In the house. Get smoke on the windows. 110. Or uh, what is that? Yeah, it's 105 again. for you. There's another shooter directly in front of you. Karzan coming around. Finds Foo, takes him out. Sturban is all alone yeah, here. Thanks. Tarzan finds another kill there on Sturban. Foul in the train still showing out over there. Dicks. If you shoot the vehicle, if you shoot the vehicle, you can probably guess how he's saying. Uh, one meters. He's still trying to make his flank a happen. A high. Uh, well, you know, we escaped our, our clutches, okay. but our one. Eyes on the scout. Where is it? Shots. Did that hit? Uh, I'll give you the bang when I'm not. Give me it. Building shit, I'm trying to figure out where it is on this map. Um, it would be relation to you, relation to you, something. Uh, relation to me, it's really a total of five. Yeah, I don't like that. Right, well, I'm gonna reposition, try to get yeah, yeah. Can I get that more? Because I have one more round still. Um, yeah, yeah, try to get eyes. Can I get the, the sub keypad? All right, I want to move so we don't, you know, get. Um, kind of blown to smithereens because they were not. I'm, out I'm trying edge. to figure this out. It's like Juliet 1253. It's directly to my north west, about like 80 meters or something. Like that. How close to Frog? Uh, does Command know what they um, want to do with the other guy? It's closer to me than Frog. frog. He's the lone this is so guy us. This, this map sucks right now. I can't figure it out. Just, I need, just need how close is it to you? I need how, close, how close to you? What direction? It's about like 100 meters to my northwest, something like that. So how, so, how is this from Frog? Or closer to you than Frog, well that means it would be closer to Frog, right? Frog uh, picking up Jays. Oh, we're the still best news yeah, the Russians have had so far. Yeah, yeah, it would be near Frog. Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't realize Frog. Copy, we're gonna go work our way towards Frog. Picking up a nut. Temper, temper. Open road. Yeah, I'm gonna run. I'm gonna move. Let me know when you're ready to watch. Private Latrine goes Behind down. Us. Bow finds Freddy, but Freddy manages to take him out. 
The Western element is completely gone at this point. It's all down to Dix and his squad. Kill on Lorenzo there. Tarzan came around the back, found Frog. Frog is now dead. Okay. I'm your token blueberry. All right, welcome to the squad. Russians are down to four men. Oh shoot! There's an so oh, there's an AR setting up a sandbag. It's an AR setting. Matt, Matt, Max, you might want to move. There's an AR setting up on a sandbag, looking at us. I'll give you a bang. Uh, 276, 277. And Max going down yep. to some long distance <laughs> fire there. That, that went about as I expected. He kind of gave us away. Yeah, I, oh fuck, now we can't push down this dude. He's literally an AR looking down this road. There is no way we're going to be able to cross this. We could smoke it. I think, I think we have to smoke it. I, I think we're smoking to keep going at this point. Yeah, I've smoked as well. I think we just. Uh, I'll use one of mine. Send it. If you want. I got one. I'm gonna throw one more uh, west. Throw it in space. Make one more north. That was gonna overlap, whatever. Yeah, we, we have to move though. The longer we stay here, the more they're gonna figure out that we're here. That's, they're gonna concentrate. They can wall bank us through these uh, fences too. I know. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna send it. I'm gonna I'm gonna risk it. Copy. Okay. Actually, I'm gonna wait for I'm gonna wait for the reload. I'm gonna wait for the reload. That should be it. Yep. Wow, it's getting close. I'm going. Going. Bouncing. I just still shooting where we were. That, baby. That's good. Let's uh. I, I feel like there's like a dozen of them left though, but we'll, we'll see what we can do. Yeah. <laughs> Got one AT. It's a pretty good force multiplier. I'm already on. We got good one, so I'm pretty much. I'm pretty much gonna die if I get shot at. If if someone sees me before I see them, I'm pretty much dead. I'm full health and I have a plenty of ammo, so. I don't have a single. I don't think. Mag. I don't think they've seen us cross. No. Yeah, I don't know. He's shooting like he hasn't. Um, just be careful. Here, watch out. There's an opening. Take, hug the right side so they don't. They don't see us. Roger. What is he shooting at, dude? What the? He's Did he really farther. get them that bad? Like, I don't know what they're shooting. At. I had my crossing boy pond, that was scary, I just turned it off. Probably right before we Yeah, I, th I think it's... I think the... I think it's like 60 meters west-southwest of us. Unless they, they can't move it. it, it has to be close. Right. Is there any use in taking it out at this point? Um, I think we just capture it at this point. Okay. I mean, we, we can't destroy it, we don't have the... Uh, do we the, uh, dig down the radio, points. or do we just like hold on it? I don't... We I think, down, no, right? I think the objective is the vehicle. We just need to, okay. we just need to get that. Alright, I'm going for it. I might shot here. Hey, farm. Alright, we have to cross a field. Okay, this might, we might be screwed. Boomers, we're not going to get hit by one freaking frag. Right. They're still shooting down the... Nope, they're looking, they're they're shooting down this we road. They're, they're still shooting down the road. We might be able to jump them here. Uh, oh, it's right here. Two-story yellow building. It's like in between this building right here and the, uh, the okay. one-story. It's <clears> really <throat> close. It's in this cluster of buildings. 
Yep, I seen a guy right in front of us by the blue building. All right, they're coming up on the objective here. Close. Dix is looking to throw a nade. in there. They were dug in there. Alright, it's frag time. That was a very good nade, but there was nobody in there. I'm crawling along the road over here. Alright, I'm gonna... I'll, I'll hold here. I wanna... Yeah, I'll hold if here. To my north, I'm totally He's coming to you. Gonna just... Come towards me. Oh, I'm dead with a grenade. It's been an honor. Dix goes down. There's only two guys left. Hey, are you guys in that building on the left? He's in this building I'm right next to. I can hear him running around. In the building? Yep. To my west, like one closest to me. Yep. Just spraying and praying. Karzan finds Apocalypse Joe. That man has quite a few kills. Five kills racked up on Karzan. Tarzan also picking up Russian Slinger. Come out of this alive. It's going to be GG and another militia victory for round two of Operation Cloudfire. All right, folks, that's going to conclude our stream for tonight. Uh, appreciate you guys working through the. Uh, weird map bugs that we had earlier. Sorry for the delay. Uh, but we know that your time is valuable here at Squad Up, so I'm going to go over some of the events we have coming up and let you guys get on with your evening. Uh, this weekend we're going to be having Operation Farmer's Fate. That's going to be happening at 1.45 p.m. Eastern Time and is open to all. Uh, we have a slot basic course available this Sunday. It's going to be at 2.30 p.m. Eastern Time. If you don't have your slot basic, make sure you get in there and get that. Looks like we do still have some slots available for that. And next Wednesday, we're going to be having an operation that I cannot pronounce, so I'm not going to try to. That'll be at 8.45 p.m. on Wednesday. All right, that's, uh, that's it. That's all I got. My cat is destroying the environment behind me, so I got to go. Uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in tonight. Uh, thank you to the viewers. Thank you to the players. Thank you to the commands and the staff and the EAs for making everything happen. We appreciate you guys very much here at Squad Ops. Hope you all have a fantastic night and a wonderful weekend ahead of you.